Hello again, everybody. Mental Fox here. Welcome back to Skyrim. Uh, so <laughs> uh, normally before I start playing an episode, I'll go back and look at the end of the previous episode to remind myself where I was, but I forgot to do that this time. And it's been about two weeks since I last played. So uh, when this came up, I was like, what? Where the heck am I? Where am I? Why am I here? Actually, I think I do know why I'm here. Isn't this where we spoke to Rasad at the end of the last episode? I think that's what we did. I think we finished off. Uh, yeah, uh, we finished off spirits away. I gave Rasad the last. Whoops! I gave Rasad the last bottles of aged Flynn. In return, he paid me with an enchanted ring that aids the wearer in moving quickly and silently. The aged Flynn must have been very special indeed. So he gave us a ring. Do I care about this ring? I don't know if I do or not. I don't even remember what it was called, but we can search for rings. Uh, the ring of Khajiit. I'm wearing it. You move 10% faster allows you to cast the spell hide. Meh. Whatever. We put it on. What are we doing? Standing out here. Let's take a look at the map, see where we are. We're just here... Just south of Fort Graymore, a little west of White Run. Take a look at our quest list, and we're doing Fishing Legend here. For my final challenge, the fish I am to catch are both rare and found in locations all over Skyrim. Angelfish, which we've already caught, can be found in temperate lakes and can only be caught with an Alikri fishing rod. Uh, the Lyre Tail Anthias, which we've already caught, can be caught in temperate streams with the Alikri Rod as well. Anglers, which we have not caught yet, are only caught in freezing waters using the Argonian, Argonian Fishing Rod. And then finally, Scorpion Fish, which we've already caught, are found underground. Like the Angler, Scorpion Fish can only be caught by using the Argonian Fishing Rod. So we need to catch an Angler. We've caught everything else. Anglers are only caught in freezing waters, so we need to head north into freezing waters. What is freezing waters? Do, is this freezy enough here in Morthal, or do we need to go all up here north of Dawnstar? I don't know, but I'm thinking we may as well just walk on over here to Whiterun Stables and hitch a ride, and we'll take it up to... I don't know, maybe Dawnstar, maybe do some fishing along the coast there. Um, you know, do I have a map of that part of the world? I don't know. Uh, in the last episode, I talked a lot about, you know, I don't know where the pale is. I don't know where the rift is. And you guys told me, and I don't remember what you said. <laughs> uh, East March, I do know, is kind of like, you know... Um, I guess this part of the map around Windhelm, I don't know if it goes all the way up to Winterhold, but this is kind of East Marchy, uh, down here around Riften, I know is the Rift, that makes sense, Riften, Rift, I think it goes over here to Iverstead, and we've got, um, the Pale, which, uh, I don't remember where the Pale is, I know you guys told me, but I don't remember. And then um, there's also s some other place that I don't have a map for, I don't think. And I think it's the frozen waters part that I really need. The pail has this little body of water down here. And there's a couple of places up north uh, where maybe we could do a little bit of fishing. Um... Let's see if I can translate that. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure. I think that there's a fishing place right here, just outside of Dawnstar. But I'm not sure. I don't... Yeah, see, this is the little body of water that we saw here. fishing around this body of water and there's fishing up here yeah let's go ahead and just uh walk over here to white run stables 
and we'll catch a ride up to Dawnstar. And we'll fish along the northern coast and hopefully we hopefully we'll ugh, we'll find an angler sooner rather than later. And then we can finish our fishing mastery. And then after that I don't know what we're going to do. I don't know. We'll uh we'll worry about that when the time comes. All right. Where the heck am I? Which way is Yeah, we want to go this way. Who's coughing? Who was it? Maybe somebody up there. I don't know. Not worried about it. Did I go the wrong way? Yep, I spun myself around and started going the wrong way. Isn't that funny? <laughs> uh, let's all have a good laugh about it. Nice day for a walk, looks like. It's a little bit of clouds in the sky up there. Hey, what's going on, guys? Oh, it's the Revelers. Uh-huh. Yeah. Ah, but you look tired. Come, share a bottle of hunting brew mead with me. Um, it's so funny. These are the only choices that we have. There is no choice to be like, uh, look, I got someplace I gotta be, all right? So sure, I'll share a drink with your friend. Ah, nothing like fine spirits to help raise your... Well, your spirits. Mm -hmm. Cheers, my friend. Okay. May your adventures find you fame and fortune. Thanks. I don't know if I've ever, like, actually drank the mead. Like, right now. Whoa, what just happened? Where? Oh. Mead. Mead. Eat. I'm gonna eat it. There, I just ate it. There. I truly reveled with them. And I will be on my merry way. So colorful. There's Dragon's Reach up there. Obviously, I do have a lot of mods installed. I have a list of those mods. There's a link to that list in the uh, description of this video. It's not 100% correct because I have had to make some changes that are not reflected in that list, but it's pretty close. Okay, here's the stables here. We'll hitch a ride. Hey, dude. Need a ride? Uh, that's why I'm here. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Oh. Where do you want to go? Can you take me to Dawnstar? Climb and back and we'll be off. Okay. So there once was a hero named Ragnar. Right. is looking at me like, do I get to come too? I would like it if my companion climbed into the carriage with me. I just think that would be a nice touch. Because he's coming with me. He's here. That looks suspicious, that guy running up that hill there. But yeah, here's Dirkethus right here. Guy's in a hurry. This kid's in a hurry. Well, it's cold here. You know, you have to you have to jog wherever you're going so that yes. you don't freeze to death. Thanks again for helping reopen the East Empire Company. Whoa, what was that? What's this? What's this song? What was that? Move it, move it! Dragon soul absorbed? <laughs> okay, apparently, I guess that's what all those people were running around for. Perhaps there was a dragon attacking and people ran around and killed it. And I guess since I'm in the vicinity, I get to absorb the soul. <laughs> that's funny. Uh, let's see here. If we look at the map, that little map again I have of the pale... I think there's fishing right right nearby. Yeah, I mean, isn't this like the there's three X's? No, there's four X's actually. There's one in the lower right as well. Uh, second from the left, isn't that where I'm standing right now? Isn't that Dawnstar? I feel like it is. 
It's like right around here, I feel like. Uh, and maybe this is it right here. Yeah, buddy. Okay, I'm going to equip my Argonian fishing rod and, um, I'm going to, um, you know, hope today is our lucky day. This would be fantastic if we just got an angler right here, right now, and we didn't have to spend a whole episode looking for a fish. There's actually some fish swimming around in there. Maybe I should just jump in head first and see if I can grab one of them. And Arctic char. I want to see what kind of fish these are. Uh, we've got a salmon. 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 Oh. Salmon. Okay, well. Um. <laughs> Durkethus. Okay, it looks like we're just. This is just a bunch of salmon in here. We're not going to find any anglers, huh? They look different to me. Some of. I guess there's the male and the female of the species. Because some of them look like they're a little bit more colored than the others. Okay. Well. It's worth a shot, right? There's a lot of them out there. Tell you what, if you're looking for salmon, buddy, this is the place to go. And, I mean, salmon's good eating. Alright, here we go. Attempt number two. Turkey, let's get away from the water. You're scaring away the fish, man. Juvenile mud crab. I don't want a juvenile mud crab. I don't want any kind of mud crab. Juvenile, fully grown, elderly, not interested. Looking for angler. If we don't catch it here, we'll move a little bit west to the next fishing spot we see on our map. And then, um, if that doesn't work, we'll come back here, uh, we'll spend the night, and we'll try again tomorrow. I mean, this is, this is our retired life. We fish and sleep and walk. A lot of walking. Oh, I got excited there for a moment. This is a different looking fish. Don't know what the angle looks like. Well, I don't want tongs. I think this spot is fished out. I think it's fished out, man. Okay, we're going to move on. First, I'm going to drop these tongs. It'll leave them here. You know, maybe... Maybe somebody... Is looking for some tongs. And they'll be really excited when they find that. Be like, oh yeah, f tongs! Heck yeah, man! That's what they'll be like. It'll be like that. Something like that. It was a recreation of what'll happen. Okay, let's take a look at this map I've got. And uh, we'll see if I'm right. And that there's another place just west of here to fish. Indeed, there is about halfway between this inlet and that outlet. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. We're going to go right around here. Uh, hello. Okay, right, right about there, I feel like, right? Something like that. We need to get on the other side of the water, though. This is a nice little... I'm going to call this place a hamlet. I have no idea. 
I don't know what a hamlet is. A small village. Seems pretty... Pretty villagey. Pretty small. Uh, wow, not much of a coast to walk on here. Okay, so somewhere around here we should see another place for fishing. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give those horkers a wide berth. I mean, not that I'm afraid of them or anything. I just would rather not. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. I don't, I don't really want to kill the wildlife if I don't have to. Oh, there's a little, little fishing hut here, maybe. Oh, yes. Let's see, do I have Kine's piece at the ready? I do. There's a fishing spot right there. I think I scared somebody. What? What happened? What happened? Somebody attacked me? I don't know what that flash was. Use fishing supplies. Alright. Well, this is a nice view. I don't think we've fished here before. Whoa. That was kind of neat. You see that tide coming in? I don't know. Come on now. Oh, that ain't it. I kind of like it here. Oh, man, I got excited there for a moment because that one was a different color than the other ones we've been picking up. But no, it's a cod. Another delicious fish. Fry it up. Batter it. Fry it up. I don't really do that much anymore. I'm getting older. Don't don't eat the fried foods like I used to, but I still still love them. But it's not, not good for the old, uh, the old heart, you know what I'm saying? So now, fried food is a treat that I enjoy, I don't know, maybe once a quarter. In fact, oh man, my girlfriend and I just got back from a trip to uh, Florida. We were in the um, Cape Canaveral area because we uh, saw a rocket launch. It was freaking awesome. But anyway, since we were on the coast... We decided to treat ourselves to some seafood, and I'm a big fan of fried shrimp, so I got me some fried shrimp, and it was disappointing. It had no flavor. <laughs> I was so mad, because like I said, I, I probably eat fried food like once a quarter, maybe, so this was like a big treat for me, and it was hugely disappointing. And thus far, our fishing has been hugely disappointing. Yeah. Oh, what are you doing there, buddy? Oh. Oh my gosh. Hi. Hi, kitty. Hello. Hello, how are you? I think he's taking bites out of me. There's blood on the ground. Look, now maybe that's his blood. I wonder why he's not attacking me. Isn't that funny? Oh, oh. And now he's dead. Great. Right, right where I'm trying to fish. <laughs> Maybe the blood will um, draw fish, but I, I think we're fished out here for the day. I think we are. We cast. Yeah, you see there was like no activity on the water. So uh, we fished this part out. So this angler is going to be a pain in the butt, isn't it? This is going to be the, uh, the tricky wicket, as they say. Do they say that? I don't know. So, I, unfortunately, I don't remember what I picked up at all. Was it a basket? No. Was it wick or something? No. I don't I don't know what we just picked up. Um, and I don't think that there's a junk choice up here, is there? So, I could do value to weight and um, a tankard. We may have just picked that up. I don't know why I have two fishing rods. We'll drop one of those. And, um, 
Nem oh, empty wine bottles. We'll drop those here. What else could I drop? Well, unfortunately, I wasn't really paying attention to the crap we picked up. And there's a very good chance I just scrolled right by it. Oh, well. That's fine. I ain't worried about it. Plop. Oh, that's actually it. I think it, maybe it was an empty wine bottle I fished up. Uh, can I just sleep in this little hut right here? Sounds like somebody's hammering on something. Is someone here? Oh, hey. What's up, fisherman? It's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. The y'all can hardly eat every year now, can you? Do you mind if I sleep here? Can I sleep here? Yeah. All right. Well, what 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 time of day is it? 4.47 p.m. Um, I think I need to uh, sleep for a good 24 hours, don't I? In order for it to be the, the next day so I could fish again. Enjoy a drink of my beverage while we wait for 24 hours to pass here. The 19th of Sun's Height. There we go. I'm going to assume I've read Toliff's journal before. Talks about fishing. Yeah, this was the uh, the mud crab problem, I believe. Yeah. Well, it's a new day. Uh-huh. She's been fishing in these parts for years. A spell tome for candlelight. Alright. Don't leave a perfectly good fishing tome. Or fishing tome. Spe casting or whatever spell tome there. Okay, let's um let's do this again. And once we fish this out, if we don't catch our angler, we'll go back to Dawnstar and try again. Actually, now that I, now that I'm thinking about this, I th did it say lakes and streams? Did it say that in the book? I might have to look at the book. I might have to go to a lake or a stream instead of the ocean. I might be fishing in the wrong place. I might be wasting our time here. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at the book Fishing Mastery Volume 5 where he talks about the angler. Angler. It just says caught in freezing waters. That's all it says. I mean, this is about as freezy as it gets. Wouldn't you agree? It's rarely caught. Sure, 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 sure. Seen in any weather. Just caught in freezing waters. That's it. That's all we have to go off of. Really? Yeah, I'm not seeing any activity on the water when I cast. Makes me wonder if this thing really did reset. And I slept for 24 freaking hours. I really didn't sleep that whole time. I like to think I was just in there maybe reading a book or something, you know. Just relaxing, hanging out with our fisherman friend. So we did. Just took a little, little respite. Yeah, there's some activity on the water. All right, now. Yeah, a little bit of activity there. getting a lot of arctic char. We're going to eat good tonight. I don't I don't even know if arctic char is a real fish. I'm going to assume it is cuz the others seem to be real. Have you seen long fin? So I believe that the game engine is just 
doing some random number generation. And I don't know what the percentages are. I think they're listed online, but you know, there's a certain percent chance that you're going to ca catch a rare fish. And it's a pretty small percentage, which uh, surprises me. The last episode, how much luck we had catching those rare fish. All right, I think it's time to move on. Let's go take a look at our inventory. We're going to drop off some junk, some junkity junk. Come on. There we go. Uh, we're going to drop these tongs. Bucket. Tankard. That might be all that we picked up. All right. Mental Fox was here. All right, let's go back to the Dawn Star. We'll fish over there again. I mean, we caught fish. If we were just looking for fish to eat, we're going to eat good. But unfortunately, we are looking for a specific fish. And thus far, we have not had any luck. And if we don't catch it here, I might have to cheat and go online and see where we could find this fish specifically. Dude, it's cold out here. Put on a shirt. Blonde. What's up, man? See, he was in a hurry because he was cold. Okay, let the fishing excitement continue. I am looking forward to finishing our fishing challenges. In large part, just to see what happens next. But also, so that hopefully we don't have to fish anymore. <laughs> this is... Not the most thrilling or exciting thing in the world, but it is peaceful, and I'm glad you're here with me. And it's just a nice way to pass the time, right? No shortage of salmon out there on the water. Hey, 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 all right, we got the angler. Let's take a look at this bad boy. Angler, check him out. Check him out. Yes. All right, hold on a minute. I'll look over here. So, well, the, well, the. There we go. We'll go here. We'll look at him this way, so we get a good look at him. Angler. It's funny we have some angler larva. Here we go. What do you think about that? Looks like he's uh sewn together he's made out of like old leather and uh, those are the stitches look at that we did it man we did it hey and we can grab a boat here take us back to rift and i believe but first let's take a look at the quest uh no no text here we just need to return to swims in deep water and just say in your face dude hey man i'm sorry to interrupt your reading but um yeah, I, I need to hire a boat. I can take you to any port on the coast. Cool, man. What about Riften? Oh. Why did I think he would take me to Riften? I guess it's not a port, is it? Solitude or Windhelm. Farewell. Well, that doesn't help me any, does it? Although, I've said that, it, it will help me. Um, because there... Solitude or Windhelm, I can catch a carriage. Right? So if he takes me to Windhelm, we could just go here. So take me to Windhelm, good sir. May not look like much, but my boat can get you there faster than walking. Hey, I don't, yes. I don't disagree with you. Where are you headed? Why don't you just take me over to Windhelm? Climb on in the boat and get comfortable. Thanks, man. I mean, it doesn't really look very comfortable, but I appreciate the ride for fifty gold. Pfft. It's steep. Pretty steep.
And now I need to go for a swim. Looking to hire a boat? It's cold. Pretty excited that we've got all these fish. Okay. Standing right on top of the fire. Look at that. He is... He must be really cold. Are you okay, Rosinda? A welcome to you, fellow traveler. Thanks. Uh, she's doing some... What is that? Coal? Coal? What is it called? Hot coal walking? I don't know. There's a name for it. I don't remember what it is. Fire walking? Yeah, man. I can take you to any of the hold capitals. Oh, okay. <laughs> Where do you want to go? Um, can you take me to Riften, maybe? Climb and back, and we'll be off. Oh, okay. Thanks. Nice weather for a ride. Hope it lasts. Really? This is nice weather? Hey, whatever floats your boat, pal. Golly, it is so, so dark here. Good day, friend. Keeping well? Good day. What's up, Shader? Well, hey, that's not something you see every day. Yeah. Until next time. Whoa. What's up? What's going on? God damn you. Dragon? Look at this. It is, it's too dark to fight a dragon. <laughs> if I go in, in here, um, will we still be fighting the dragon? A lot of people are just running into the safety of the, the city. Oh no! I thought he was dead there from- Go get him, y'all. I'll let them handle that. I'm gonna go get some sleep. It was a long trip. <laughs> My dragon fighting days are over. I'll leave that to the other people. Ayana, what's up? Good to see you. Has the store made any money? It has. Here, this is your house. Fifty-nine hundred gold. <laughs> Holy cow! How are the kids doing? Oh, fine. If you want to bring up little pickpockets, this place is a terrible influence on a child. No more. I need, I need. Fine. If you want to bring up little pickpockets. I got you a present, Papa. I hope you like it. Potion of Minor? I do like it. Thanks. That's actually a really good present. Whoa, we're... Oh, she's over there. That was a neat trick. A Potion of Minor Healing. That was actually a really good present. Thank you. Uh, shouldn't you be in bed? It's 12.21 a.m. What kind of kids are you raising, Iona? Don't blame me. You're the one who let them stay up till 12.30 in the morning. What are you doing? That's a pretty neat magic trick. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Pretty cool magic trick. Anyway, I'm going to bed. You guys just keep it down out here, all right? I, I need to get some sleep. I need to good, get a good eight hours of sleep. Ah, <sighs> nothing like sleeping in your own bed. And ain't that the truth? Ugh, I told you we just got back from from Florida. And we stayed in a, a VRBO. And the place was nice. It was right on the beach. But God, the beds were horrible. It's a king-sized bed, but it wasn't really. It was like two regular-sized cots, like, next to each other with king-sized bedding on it. It was terrible. Everything else about the place was so nice that they just totally cheaped out on the bed. Ugh. You gotta, you gotta have a nice bed. Oh, I guess he's in the bunkhouse. You're as good as dead. You're as good as dead? What's going on? What happened? Why is she hiding from me? Mercy, what's going on? Did I do something? What's, what's, what is going on? You're not afraid of me, are you? Catching fish and cooking them? Even breeding them? Those are tools and means, not art. Uh-huh. Hey, man. It wasn't easy, but... Here are the fish you asked for. It is from the bottom of my heart that I declare you a legendary angler and a dear friend. Oh. Please accept this gift. Thanks. Are there any more fishing challenges you can give me? Please say no. 
You've already learned all oh, good. I can teach you. Okay. Uh, I guess we're done here. Mm -hmm. Why is everybody freaking out? I didn't do anything. I'm leaving. Goodbye. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, she's out here now. Get out of here. Go away. Are you scared of me too? Yeah, I didn't think so. Oh, uh, let's see. Inventory. He gave me fang of something. Fang. Fang of... Hey, Nick. Hey, Nick. Hey, Nick. Namit. Target takes 31 points of shock damage. And half as much magicka damage. Pretty specific. Isn't that great? You know what? Let's see if I have a place to hang that in Honeyside. Let's go see. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why everybody's freaking out. I mean, I didn't even draw my weapon when that... Dragon came around. So I don't know why they'd be freaking out around me. Okay, th this one... It's just a dumb old iron sword. You know what I'm saying? Is there anything downstairs where I could put it? Um. I haven't really seen a place. I don't have any. Oh, she's playing with the bunny. That is adorable. Um. Yeah, I think I might just replace, uh. That iron sword upstairs with this thing. Let's do that. So, I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna take the iron sword. Now I'm going to... I think I need to equip this thing, don't I? Equip the fang. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, that won't keep me up at all at night. Trying to sleep and there's this glowing sword over top of me. <laughs> Pretty neat, though. Um, let's see here. I think... I think I just put weapons in here. Put that dumb old iron, and sword, iron sword in here just to get rid of it. Wow, we have a lot. We are carrying a lot of stuff. Holy moly. Holy moly. Iron sword. There we go. All right. Well... Um, quest wise, you know, the quests that I have left, I guess, I guess we could go ask Varia about additional fishing bounties around Skyrim. I guess we could do that. Let's go do that. See if she has anything else for us to fish up. Since we're such a fishing master now. Splash. There we go. What's this place down here? I don't know if I've ever walked down here before, have I? There's nothing very interesting down here. All right, where are you? Naraya, I think that's her name. I like the size of that crab. It's, his name is Snippy. Varia. Mud crabs are fascinating creatures, don't you think? I tell you, man, it looks like your juvenile mud crab is growing up fast. Adorable, right? Yeah. That's how people feel when they give us a curious look. I'm sure that's what they're thinking. Hey, um, do you know of anyone in need of fishing work around Skyrim? You're headed to the capital. Oh. This is an unusual request coming from a tricky client. Oh. It would help business a lot, and you are most suitable for the task. Oh. Uh, let's see here. Reed wanted a seafood feast. All right, then. All right, then. Okay, seafood feast. I wanted a seafood feast. Our tenants have all paid their rent on time for once, so I find myself suddenly flush with coin. I've decided to celebrate with a feast. 
Of course, the innkeeper at the Winking Skeever possesses neither of the ingredients nor the skill to prepare what I desire. I seek a cooked arctic char. We got one of those steamed crab legs. I don't know about that. And a helping of crab stew. Oh, boy, for good measure. Crab? Please set a table on the second floor of the inn so that I might avoid being disturbed. What? I will leave behind generous repayment once my dining has concluded, but only if the meal meets my expectations. Unfortunately for me, few things do. Jizzly? Gizzly? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, oh, jeez. Okay. Now let's see how this goes. Uh, the ultimate feast. Obtain a pair of steamed crab legs. Obtain a cooked arctic char- Cooked? Oh, no. Oh, jeez. I have to cook stuff? Oh, man. I don't know how to do that. Ah, oh, gee whiz. Turn this off. Uh, Gizzly, in solitude, has requested a huge seafood meal. The innkeeper does not stock everything she would like, so I'll need to collect all of the food in Gizzly's bounty letter in order to set a table for her on the second floor of the Winking Skeever. Uh, obtain a bowl of crab stew, obtain a cooked arctic char, obtain a pair of steamed crab legs. Huh. Okay, arctic char we have, so we just need to cook it. But this crab stuff, man, I don't know if we have that. I'm not even sure where we'll get it. Ah, oh, jeez, I don't have any crab stuff other than juvenile mud crabs. Where am I supposed to find crab stuff? Um, wow. I don't know. And, um... Our uh, compass isn't going to help us any, because it's not going to tell me where in the world to go for this stuff. Hey, you. Yes. Okay, she's not going to help us any either. I'll take my leave then. Um. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well. Tidings. Tidings. Um. I'm trying to think if I know of a place to cook something. Can I... Do I have a place to cook in, in Honeyside? I don't think I do. I'm pretty sure I do in my home in... Winter. Well, not Winterhold. Um, Whiterun. Right? Where am I supposed to get this crab stuff? I don't know how to catch crab. I don't know where to catch crab. Here we go. Use cooking pot. She's my sword and my shield. Hmm, interesting. Uh, cooking pot. Cooked Arctic char. What do you need, my thing? You lack the required ponent components. I require a salt pile. What do you really? Need, see crab. Okay, in order to make crab stew. I need crab meat, leek, garlic, and potato. Oh, for crying out loud. Now I'm doing grocery shopping? Mama took me to the ah, jeez. And then I'm supposed to do some kind of legs. Is, but I don't think it was mud crab legs, was it? Steamed crab legs. Are those different than steamed mud crab legs? How do I get an, a recipe for that? Honor to you. Man, I don't know. Did you need something, Papa? Ah, oh, jeez. Salt pile, crab meat, leek, garlic, and potato. Yes. Where am I supposed to get this stuff? I don't know. Need something? I don't know. Salt pile, I'm pretty sure, is not something I've been collecting. I've been throwing, like, just rando stuff in these barrels. But I don't think salt pile is one of those things. I got fire salts, I got frost salts. I do not have salt pile. I'll be damned. Look at that salt pile. It's my freaking lucky day, man. Well, we could at least make the um, Arctic char. Let's see how this works. What do you need, my thing? Uh, Arctic char. 
Do you want to create this item? Yes. We obtained a cooked arctic char. Need something? Well, look at all the stuff we can make with all this other salt pile we've got. Long life to you, Thane. Need something? <laughs> crab stew, crab meat, leek, garlic, potato. Honored to see you again, my Thane. I'd say there's a zero percent chance I have any of this stuff. Pardon me, manic electro nymph. That we have any of this stuff in here, right? Because I, I, I do not even pick this stuff up. Um, no crab. No leek. No potato. I don't even remember what the other thing was. Gee whiz. Honored to see you again, my thing. Well, I think I'm gonna have to write this stuff down because I'm not gonna remember it. Long life to you, Thane. Yes? So, oh, I could make cooked juvenile mud crab, but that's not what we want. Long crab stew. Yes? I need crab meat. I need leek. Hmm? I need garlic. And I need potato. What do you need, my thing? And then the other thing, I, um... I, I, I don't know if this will count. Butter. Um, because this is steamed mud crab legs, but what we're really supposed to make is just steamed crab legs. So, I don't know. Let's go out to the little uh, village out here where people sell random stuff. As a matter of fact, maybe, maybe I go back in Honeyside because we do have like a little kitchen area here that I didn't look in. Excuse me, Darkethus. Darkethus, get out of the way. How rude to stand in front of my own, my own door. Um, I mean, we've got a cupboard here. Wow, look at all the stuff that we got in here. Look at all this stuff. Really interesting. Uh, let's see here. We need uh, crab meat. No crab. We need leek. No leek. We need garlic. We have garlic. I don't know how much garlic we need. Just probably just one, right? One garlic. I'm gonna put a check mark next to garlic on my my list here. Potato. No potato. Oh, I mean, hey, we had one thing. Oh, I just need butter too. Let's see, butter. No butter. Butterfly. Wait a minute. I'm sure you saw that too, but I just now noticed it. Honored to see you again, Mike. We need. A pair of steamed crab legs. Oh, never mind. Steamed crab legs. Never mind. I was looking at the uh, hmm? recipe for steamed mud crab legs. And that requires... No. Yes? That requires mud crab legs. Okay, whatever. I don't know why I don't have steamed... I don't know how I'm supposed to learn how to make yes? steamed mud crab legs. Oh my gosh, these kids are driving me crazy in this house. Shut up. <laughs> did this what a find who ooh what happened who killed him I didn't do it I didn't do it let's see here over here we got flowers and cotton and potato plant did I see leak leak I think we have everything we need to make the crab thing just walk by that poor guy's body. Look at this. What do you need, my thing? You guys are driving me nuts. Yes. Oh, what do I not have? No. Um. Oh, crab meat. <laughs> I don't think I'm growing any crab out there in my garden. Where am I going to get crab meat? Uh, does, um, Swims in Deep Water sell Is it absolutely necessary? stuff like that? Come on in, take a look around. What do you sell? May the gods watch over your back. Thanks, man. Some may call this junk. Uh, okay. Me, I call them treasures. No crab. No crab meat. Does he have butter, maybe? Let me check for butter. Some may call this junk. Me? No butter. I 
I... What do you... Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. Word is spreading like mage fire. Get out of my way. Great evil has been vanquished. So we've got people here in the little village that sell some stuff. Azura's wisdom. Can I interest you in some fun? Everything I've got on display, really. Uh, he doesn't have any butter. He doesn't have any crab stuff. I really appreciate what you've done for me. Mm -hmm. I'll never forget it. You gonna buy something? Everything I've got on display, really. Uh, no butter, no crab stuff. Come back when you're ready to spend more gold. Do you sell stuff? Ours. See for yourself. Nope. Nothing here. Safe travels, land strider. It is cute that there's little little villages here. It's so good to see you again. Uh huh. Well. Oh, she sells good stuff. We're one of the same kind, you and I. Just what you see here. Butter. But no crab anything. So, looks like I need crab, crab meat. Thanks again for the ice wraith tea. Uh huh. Well, I'm gonna end this episode here. I may go online and see where I'm supposed to get this stuff. Um, but I do now have leek, garlic, potato, and butter. I just need crab meat and crab legs, I guess. Look out, crabs. Crabs see me coming. They better turn and walk the other way. All right, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me on this episode. I hope you had a good time. If you did, uh, I don't know, maybe let me know. Leave me a like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.